Hello world! On today's episode, we'll be talking about solar systems. It all starts with the sun. So to catch that energy and turn it into electricity, we use a solar panel. The panels that I'm using for this project will put out anything from 0 to 20 volts, depending on the time, cloud cover, and angle of the sun. Next, we need to buffer and store the electricity with a battery. I'm using a 12 volt lead acid system for this build, but there's other chemistries used for solar electric systems, each with their trade-offs. Lithium systems such as Tesla's Powerwall are great for energy per unit weight and current supply, but only have a certain amount of charging cycles. Lead acid batteries, on the other hand, are heavy and have toxic chemicals, but they have longer lifetimes than lithium ion and have a good current output. Nickel iron aka Edison batteries, are something I want to explore in the future. While they have lower current outputs, they can theoretically last forever. If we can manufacture these on Mars, they may be the best option for energy storage. Next, you have your load. Lights, inverters to get alternating current, motors, etc. Your load needs clean output power. Uh, for this system, I'm using uh, 12 volts. So we need to tie all these systems together and make sure that we have the clean output and a steady charging voltage for our batteries, thus the charge controller. And that's the theory for your basic off-grid solar system. Tomorrow I'll be posting a build video and I'm going to continue posting every day Monday through Friday. If you'd like to follow along, subscribe to this channel and if you have questions or ideas, feel free to leave a comment below. Thanks for tuning in.